Finally tonight, sometimes the most rewarding journey is one that you never hope to make. Here's Steve Hartman on the road. Along a busy road in Chico, California, there's a memorial to a young college student killed on her bike by an alleged drunk driver. Christina Chesterman was just 21. She was going to be a nurse, but she had a lot of other dreams that no one really knew about until a few months ago when her mom and dad went to clean out her old apartment. I opened up a drawer and I found just this makeup bag. Sandra says there was no makeup. Instead, in that zippered compartment, she found a single sheet of notebook paper, Christina's bucket list. I mean, what kid writes a bucket list? There's not many. Christina probably wrote it in high school. Can you read some of what's on there? Sure. She wanted to tour Niagara Falls, save someone's life, which she did that many times over. How'd she do that? By donating her organs. She saved lives. This next one makes me laugh. She wanted to break up a fight between two guys over her, <laughs> which I think is so cute. And I don't know that it ever happened, but it should have. When Sandra and her husband David found the list, they say they knew exactly what they had to do. Because she didn't get to do this, we wanted to complete it for her. A few weeks ago, they crossed Niagara Falls off their daughter's bucket list. They've taken flying lessons and run through a field of poppies. But here's the best part. Sandra and David aren't the only ones going through Christina's list right now. After posting it on Facebook, thousands of people, most of them total strangers, started doing it too. And although Sandra cries every time she reads about someone else's new adventure, she and David are both so thankful their daughter turned out to be such an inspiration. I think that's just amazing that she could have that effect on somebody that never even knew her. It's hard still to get up in the morning, but this is what does it. This is what gets me up. Obviously, their brand of sightseeing is no vacation, but they say remembering their daughter's zest for life is a whole lot better than the futility of trying to forget it. Steve Hartman, on the road in Niagara Falls, New York.